Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to our channel. Uh, now it's time for us to learn the cells format. Cells format you can see over here. The cells ribbon in MS Excel is a part of home tab and contains various formatting and editing options that allows us to work with individual cells or cell ranges within Excel worksheet. The cell ribbon provides quick access to common cell related functions. We will go through some of the key options found in the cells ribbon today. Okay, now in the cells option, the first option we have is the insert tab. This menu allows to insert new cells, rows or columns before or after the selected cell or cells. To do this, let me just have some data, share some data with you. This is a data. If I click here and if I need to insert a cell, I can insert a cell over here. These are the options. If I need to have it in right, see, the data has been moved towards right. Similarly, if I want to move it uh, in any other direction, I can do that. So like down option, this is the down. And if I just need to insert a new row instead of cell, it have the entire row and tile column option as well. The next option in uh, this insert is insert raw, sheet rows, like rows and columns. And if I need to insert a new sheet, it will insert a new sheet like this, okay? Now, let's move on to the next option that is delete. Delete is also an easy option, similarly as uh, we uh, have seen the insert options. Now we can de delete cells, rows, columns, or delete a sheet. After this, we have got format. In format, we have one, two, three, four different options. The first option has cell sizes. These are the options where we can adjust our cell sizes as per height, either its height or weight, or uh, like in column or rows, height of it can be adjusted from here. Visibility, if I need to hide a row, a column, or a sheet, or again, unhide the rows or columns, I can use these options from here. Organize the sheets, if I need to rename the sheet, I can click here, and this will give me the option, and I can rename the new sheet, like I can rename as new, it's done. Other option is move a copy sheet if I need to move it. I have the option if I need to copy the same things in a new sheet, uh, select a new, a new sheet will be created with the same data. There we are, see? This is a new sheet created with the same data. I'll move that back to my sheet and it was already moved, it was not copied, okay? So again from here, I'll move it back to my original sheet. And this can be done as a copy as well, create a copy. This will now create a copy. I'll move it back to the sheet where it came from and I'll ask it to move it to the end. And there it is, it's moved again. The next option here is the tab color. If I need to change the tab colors, it will be colored. See, it's green now. This can be seen now properly, right? And these are the options which will be covered in uh, the other tabs. Like if I need to protect the sheet using a password, this can be done. If I need to use uh, like a lock a cell, it can be done from here. Format cell is another, again, uh, the entire menu, which we have seen uh, here. If we click here, this menu can be found from there as well. And these this have number alignment, uh, font, border, fill, protection, different options, okay? So please do explore these options do, and do let me know if you have any question or suggestion. I believe you have already subscribed to my channel. If not, please do so. Thank you so much for uh, watching our video and uh, see you again in our next video. Take care. Bye-bye.